Here we go. Yeah. So you see, folks, what you miss. Yeah, well, I was just um, kind of taking him on because he's been kind of cranky and um, he doesn't seem to care. And I said, well, you should care that I care that you're cranky. So that's <laughs> right where you all came in. And he thinks it's funny. It's not funny, is it? I'm not cranky. I'm funny. No, you're mixing up what I'm saying. It's, you think it's funny that I think that you're cranky. Well, I know, but cranky and funny go together. You could be a funny, cranky old man. Look, that's what I am. I'm a funny, cranky old man. By the way, there's a swimming pool behind you. Where the hell did that come from? I don't know. Yeah. But why don't you hook up the heat? The what? Why don't you hook up the heat and then we can give them a treat and go swimming? Oh. Well, I'll tell you why. Why? Because the price of gas, mm. not the gas that <coughs> you leave the restaurant with, but <laughs> the gas that is fed into all of our homes, whether we like it or not. Yeah. And when we were renting a house that we rented for 15 months while this house was being built, we had the heat on in the month of December because we had all of our kids and grandkids and significant others coming and our gas bill for that little pool for the month of December that I never even went into right was three thousand dollars yeah so that was this crazy. pool is three times bigger than the last one it'll be nine thousand dollars to heat your swimming pool but is... wasn't the idea of doing this house solar so that we didn't have well, that that will look after all the appliances etc but for some reason, the industry that provides electric heaters for pools is way behind the industry. Mm -hmm. And if you go on looking for an electric, because that way the solar could, could heat the pool. And we could keep the pool, you know, at the temperature we love it at, which is 92 degrees. We can That's keep fun. It like that, okay? <laughs> well, the last pool that was 9000 no, it was $3,000. I couldn't get in it or out of it because of my injury. And the way it was built. And they did a real artsy fartsy kind of thing, but there was no grab bar to get in or to get out. There were no steps, there was like a slope. Have you ever been injured and tried to walk down the slope in water with nothing to hold on to? And um, so I never, and then one night I did get in it and it was painful because I'd kind of slide in. And then I had to get out. How long did it take us to get me out? Half an hour. Half hour to get me out. So it was a, a wasted pool experience. So I'm waiting for this and I've been excited because, well good, this pool is going to be solar. But so far... Well the good thing about pool is it's also nice to look at. And I turned it on. Last oh, night. what you did last night was so beautiful. And there are like a hundred different colors you can yeah. the water. Yeah. And that was kind of sexy. Yeah. Then I turned on the spa, you know, the jacuzzi, the little thing without turning on the pool. Yeah. And the indicator on my phone had a little flame which indicated it was heating. And after about five hours, not only it started getting dark. Not only did the temperature not increase, it actually decreased by two degrees, which meant that the thing on my phone showing it's, it's working wasn't working. So now we have to call the gas company. <laughs> gas company. <laughs> so you know what happened today? What? Well, you know. I was very excited because my... She was an amazing, amazing woman. She was doing okay. Not great, but she was doing okay, and she was heavy breathing at the very end. And I gave her a, a pill to relax the breathing, but it, it didn't work. I was grateful that I was with her when she left us. And it was very peaceful, and it was beautiful, and she was beautiful. I've been through a lot. I went into a facility in Chicago, not for cancer therapy, but for her mobility issues after she had fallen in her home in Palm Springs and broken her yeah, neck. So yeah. she was in the She's clinic so to and undergo getting, physical getting therapy help. so that she could walk. Right. And then she came home and she was okay. She wasn't great. All right, all right, and all right. Here we go. Yeah. 
do you see folks what you miss? Yeah, well, I was just um, kind of taking him on because he's been kind of cranky and um, he doesn't seem to care. And I said, well, you should care that I care that you're cranky. So that's <laughs> right where you all came in. And he thinks it's funny. It's not funny, is it? I'm not cranky, I'm funny. No, you're mixing up <laughs> what I'm saying. It's, you think it's funny that I think that you're cranky. Well, I know, but cranky and funny go together. You could be a funny, cranky old man. Look, that's what I am. I'm a funny, cranky old man. By the way, there's a swimming pool behind you. Where the hell did that come from? I don't know. Yeah. But why don't you hook up the heat? The what? Why don't you hook up the heat and then we can give them a treat and go swimming? Oh. Well, I'll tell you why. Why? Because the price of gas, mm. not mm. the gas that <coughs> you leave the restaurant with, but... <laughs> The gas that has fed into all of our homes, whether we like it or not. Yeah. And when we were renting that house that we rented for 15 months while this house was being built, we had the heat on in the month of December because we had all of our kids and grandkids and significant others coming. And our gas bill for that little pool for the month of December. That I never even went into. Right was $3,000. Yeah, so that was crazy. So this pool is three times bigger than the last one. It'll be $9,000 to heat your swimming pool. But is, wasn't the idea of doing this house solar so that we didn't have well, that? Well, that will look after all the appliances, etc. Okay? But for some reason, the industry that provides electric heaters for pools is way behind the industry. Mm. And if you go on looking for an electric, because that way the solar could, could heat the pool. And we could keep the pool, you know, at the temperature we love it at, which is 92 degrees. We could That's keep it fun. That. Okay? <laughs> well, the last pool that was 9,000, no, it was $3,000. I couldn't get in it or out of it because of my injury. And the way it was built. And, they did a real artsy fartsy kind of thing, but there was no grab bar to get in or to get out. There were no steps, there was like a slope. Have you ever been injured and tried to walk down a slope in water with nothing to hold on to? And um, so I never, and then one night I did get in it and it was painful, so I'd kind of slide in. And then I had to get out. How long did it take us to get me out. Half an hour. Half hour to get me out. So it was a, a wasted pool experience. So I'm waiting for this and I've been excited because, well good. This